It's rolling up to the money. This certified pilot. Oh. You gonna see how high I'm at, bro? Smoke, bro. Smoke 100%. He's guilty in Russian court. The W. Hold on, what is this? Brittany Griner pleads guilty in Russian court. The WNBA star was arrested at a Moscow airport in February, with Russian officials claiming she had cannabis oil in her luggage. I don't know, cannabis oil? You mean like, 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 like a, like a, like a distill? Like, like one of these distills, or like, 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 like a vape pen? Oh. Yeah. So one of my distills to this. What you mean? You mean she had she had distills? The she she had she had she had like distills like like the CBD. You can't have CBD in Russia. I would like to plead guilty on the charges. I had no intention on breaking any Russian law. If ultimately convicted on. They about to roof you, y'all. They about to roof you, y'all. Damn, bro, you all know that Russia and America ain't friends. They about, they about to hold you hostage. Try to try to hold you hostage to get fucking Ukraine fucked up. On drug possession and smuggling charges, Brittany could face 10 years in a Russian prison. Following her. 10 years in a Russian prison. Oh, they go to the Siberia, bro. Oh, shit. They're up there to Siberia, bro. You ain't going to play playing no basketball. Just fucking. Snowball fights. Her plea, Brittany's trial is expected to resume on July 14th. So, with the plea in place, her defense team and U.S. officials edge closer toward a court verdict, as well as attempts to secure Brittany's release. We are not going to ever be quiet until she's home safely. The president responded to a letter Griner wrote him from prison pleading for action. He called Griner's wife Wednesday, telling her he is working to secure Britney's release as soon as possible. Following this latest development, Britney's coach, Vanessa Nygaard, gave a passionate plea in wanting Britney home safe. I'm a basketball coach. I know about pick and rolls. I don't know a lot about Russian law. Hopefully this is a step in the right direction and we look to see the Biden administration and all of our government officials continue to do everything they can to help bring Brittany home as fast as possible. Yo, I don't know if there's anything that, no, I mean, yeah, there, there ain't shit he can do, bro. She broke, she broke the fucking law, bro. She broke the fucking law, yo. When you go in other countries and shit, bro, you gonna want to check what the fuck you can do, bro. Yeah, hey, you gonna, man, bro. Yo, when this when this when this shit when this shit blow up hundred percent, bro. If we if we go we go from stolen across the country to stolen around the world and shit, bro. We we gonna be checking what the fuck we can do and where we can go, bro. Hundred percent, bro. Also on Thursday, Brittany gets support from Megan Rapino at the White House, where the soccer star was accepting the Presidential Medal of Freedom on Megan's suit. Her lapel sports the initials BG. Megan shared this pic to her Instagram story, adding, quote, the most important part of today. I was to say, where the fuck you say BG? You couldn't see that shit in that first picture. You needed a super duper duper to zoom in. You wouldn't be able to see that shit across the room. That was up though for support here, but not me, yo. She looking at two years, I mean, the Siberia, bro. Fuck around, I mean, goddamn snowsuits, bro. It's ugly, bro.